They probably don't need my help. Uh, they look very professional, uh, but I'm just, yeah, I'm helping out. Uh, it's an independent record shop. And you know, there was the Independent Record Shops Day quite recently. And we have to look after our independent record shops otherwise, and support them, otherwise they won't exist anymore. And that would be, that, they are, yeah. I think there's something, some statistic like two thirds of, of them have shut over the last five years or something, you know. So something must be done. I don't do know something. if this is it, the something, but uh, yeah. So you've already got some customers through the door, so that's good. Yes, I'm going to try and serve them to the best of my ability. Okay. I can ask you a quick word about politics. There's not much political comment in popular music at the moment. Do you think right. that might change after the events of the last 10 days in particular? Um, maybe. I mean, I th a lot of political comment songs are rubbish. I think it's difficult because... Um, because music deals with emotional things. I think music, because it, you appreciate it emotionally, not intellectually, uh, therefore it is better dealing with um, emotional issues. But you can get emotional about politics. But it is dangerous territory. But uh, it'd be good if people... People have to write about their lives, basically, so they have to write about what's important to them. So maybe, yeah, like you say, it, because of what's gone on recently, maybe that'll make people write about it. People are feeling emotional about it for a change. Maybe, yeah, yeah. I know you had to issue a statement to say that you weren't a Conservative yeah. supporter mm. recently, mm. so it, got, it, it can be difficult making a political statement and get it being misinterpreted, can't it? Yeah, I just need to work on my uh, ways of expressing myself correctly. How much have you changed though? You're obviously not a Conservative supporter, but how much have you no, changed since I'm your not. last album has come out? Well, I've got a beard. <laughs> and you're more relaxed? Um, I don't know about that. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see how you get on then. Mm. Good luck. Thank, thank you, you yeah. Much. yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, thank you for the good wishes. <laughs> Get to work. All right, cheers. Pleasure too. Thank, Thank you. you. I did, yeah. Uh, <laughs> 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 right, all right. I put that in there first. Thank you. Right. So tell me what I should be doing with them. And you, do you want to uh, yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, really nice. Yeah, so I'll um, do those and um, really nice nice well. yeah, people okay. want it. Yeah, I think want to. Let's just get in there. Yeah. Okay. Hello, you're Hello. first. Hello. Welcome to the president. <laughs> nice to meet you. How may I help you today? May I have a copy of this very fun album? Oh, please. Of course you may. Yeah, so may I have a copy of this very fun album? Of course you may, yes. Now, do you want me to write it? Oh, yeah. All right, okay. Thank you very much. I'll do that. Okay. 
right. So yeah, so there's a there's a there's a thing in there so you can like a code so you can have it. Oh yeah. What color what color do you want me to write? Yeah, that's for it for a silver pen if you like. That's quite yeah, a cool. so. Like Jarvis, really? Yeah, he's great. It's a nice chance to meet him, and it's quite an interesting thing to um, study record to fans. It's quite a unique thing to do. I was going to say you're Hats not just meeting him; you're being yeah. served by him. Yeah, yeah, that's quite unique, and special, We're quite lucky. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you very much. Um, Twenty years. Um, well, I've been a fan for 14, nearly 15 years. My goodness. Yeah. yeah. Are you ready, Tim? Yep, yep. Yeah, oh. so just tell me you've been okay. waiting a long time. To oh, no, I feel, yes. I've seen Jarvis doing his solo work, seen him with Pulp Live not too many times, but, you know, big fan, and it's such a coup to have him come here today. I think it's really special. And love the new album. Can't wait to take it home. <laughs> Stroke it. He will have touched it, you know. <laughs> Thank you. Tell us what it's like being served by Jarvis. Pretty cool. Uh, yeah, wow, it's pretty, pretty, pretty starstruck to be honest. I mean, he's really cool. I like shook our hands and stuff. I mean, one of our mates was uh, too poor to come, so we wrote him a little note. It's pretty oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. It's really good. Lovely. So, tell us what you got then. Yeah, I've got his CD. Let's have a look. Time to write something witty. I pretty much got that, so you know. <laughs> yeah. And you got a bag as well. Yeah. And what does it say on it? Uh, your life is just to carry a bag, witty. Did you know that? <laughs> no, now I know. Of course. I think it's, it's quite cool, just like we'll be sitting in the audience as well. So. But yeah, it's nice. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Are you all right? Cheers. Sorry. Who are you with? <laughs> Sorry. I like. Oh, the picture, right. Oh, so it's on here. So I take it. So you can see it. Okay. That's pretty good. Yeah. 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 Um, oh, I'd love you to write on it if you wouldn't mind. It's actually for my partner Dave. Okay. He's a big fan, but he's um, unfortunately working, so he couldn't come in. So Dave, um, and he's a big fan. I don't know what else to say. Right, he dabbles right. in writing a bit of sci fi.